Watch 93, television's automotive magazine. Your host for Motor Week 93, John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week 93. We're glad to have you with us. Of all the benefits that cars offer us, convenience has to top the list. Being able to go where we want, when we want, is a luxury that simply wasn't available before the automobile. But when the weather takes a turn for the worst, or you have to go off the beaten path, even many of the most modern cars are about as convenient as a horse and buggy. So this week we're looking at how to get around no matter what the conditions. And we're starting off by testing a car that has helped define automobile all-wheel drive. It's the latest big wagon from Audi the 100 CS Quattro Wagon. The 100 CS Quattro Wagon is the latest in a family of all-weather Audi wagons that goes back to 1986. The most familiar of these is the striking 200 Quattro Wagon, which was discontinued in 1991. But the latest wagon to wear an Audi badge steps away from its predecessor's fastback rear with a more conventional profile. And while the 100 CS Quattro may look smaller, its actual length is less than an inch shorter than before. The styling, derived directly from the current 100 sedan, is very handsome, especially at the rear. The wide tail even holds a folding third seat for extended family capacity. And normal luggage space, while less than the previous model, is still a respectable 33.9 cubic feet, 65.5 if you fold the middle seat. Power comes from Audi's newest engine, this 2.8 liter V6. It produces 172 horsepower and 184 pound-feet of torque. But with 3,892 pounds to motivate, reaching 60 takes a leisurely 12.7 seconds. Quarter mile ends in 18.9 seconds at 77 miles per hour, with most of the engine's punch concentrated in the top of the power band. The acceleration times can be partially attributed to the Quattro system's extra weight along with the four-speed automatic transmission's tall gearing. But while the smooth Audi drivetrain may not be good for stoplight sprinting, its gradual power delivery is well suited to poor weather conditions where rapid change is not desirable. The engine's smoothness carries over to the wagon's superb handling. The massive Quattro grip made our test car feel like a much lighter machine. Feedback was plentiful through both the stiff chassis and progressive steering. At a punchier bottom end, and the Quattro wagon would beat many current sports sedans on a dry road. And with its lockable rear differential, it easily leaves them behind in the snow. Braking equipment consists of four-wheel discs with standard anti-lock all around. They stopped our test car from 60 in an average distance of 126 feet. Braking was consistently strong throughout our testing period in both good and bad weather. Once clear of the test track, the Quattro wagon showed more of its strengths with a smooth, controlled highway ride and a low 67 decibel interior noise level. Fuel economy, however, is typically luxury car light, 18 city and 22 highway. We managed 19 miles per gallon on our test loop. The 100 CS Quattro Wagon's interior boasts a long list of standard features, including a full complement of power accessories, a power moonroof, and leather upholstery. The leather covers typically firm but supportive bucket seats with eight-way power adjustments and front seat heaters to keep you comfortable on the coldest days. They face a set of large, clear analog gauges. Other standard items include a fine-sounding AM-FM cassette stereo, and automatic climate controls that are a snap to operate as long as outside air is not on your agenda. Rear seat room is plentiful. The 60-40 split seat back features the novel pull-through ski bag found in Audi sedans. And of course it folds for increased cargo space. But it's on the price tag, not in the cargo area, that you find the Quattro Wagon's biggest number. Buying one will cost you $44,250. Now that is $5,000 less than the price of a Range Rover County LWB. The Audi will easily outperform the Range Rover on regular roads. But if the weather and roads turn from bad to horrible, the Go Anywhere Rover will have the edge. The Audi 100 CS Quattro Wagon features a long list of safety equipment too. It includes driver and front passenger airbags and four-wheel anti-lock brakes. 
There's also the Quattro all-wheel drive system, of course, as well as seatbelt tensioners and 5-mile-per-hour bumpers. The Quattro wagon also meets 1997 standards for side impact protection. Hits start with the handsome styling. We also like the excellent handling, smooth ride, well-thought-out interior, and long list of standard features. Misses are the rather lackluster acceleration and climate controls that make it difficult to get fresh air. Twelve years ago, with the introduction of the first Quattro model, Audi set a standard for all weather passenger cars that is still followed today by everyone from Mercedes to Subaru. And while all-wheel drive has since become fairly common in the auto industry, few vehicles combine luxury and foul weather performance as well as the cars that started it all, those that wear the name Audi Quattro.